So after those six rounds, what you need to do before starting the variable interval timer always, remember that you're programming each round, you need to go back to round one. When you're down to round one, which is 40 seconds, then you start it with button five. And it'll start counting down on round one. It'll tell you how long round one was. And it'll change to round two as the rounds go expiring. It'll vibrate and beep to let you know it's time to change modality so you don't have to stop doing what you're doing. And uh, that's about it. We're not gonna see the whole workout, but in a couple of videos, we'll see some fun workouts using the variable interval timer. Thank you for your attention.